This video was for educators and program directors who may be interested in ultrasound certification and registration through ARRT for their students. Ultrasound is part of our mission to recognize qualified individuals in medical imaging. At ARRT, we work with a collaborative team of multidisciplinary experts who can make important decisions about content and how ultrasound imaging supports and enhances other imaging disciplines in the clinical setting. At ARRT, there are two pathways to certification and registration. We have the primary and the post-primary eligibility pathways. The primary eligibility pathway is used for students in educational programs. And the post-primary eligibility pathway is used by those who have already achieved a credential, either through ARRT or through ARDMS. Within the primary eligibility pathway, there are three areas of requirements, education, ethics, and examination. Students will need to earn a minimum of an associate degree. The degree must be from an institution accredited by an agency that ARRT recognizes. This includes programmatic accreditors such as KHEP and regional and national accreditors, among others. Additionally, as part of the program, the student will need to demonstrate competencies in a specific set of clinical procedures. Program directors that would like to have their students certified and registered through ARRT will need to send us a request to have your school recognized. This typically comes in the form of a letter from your program's dean or director and should be on school letterhead. It should indicate your request to have your program recognized, who the program director is, including their credentials. It'll also need to indicate who your accreditor is as well as the degree which will be granted by your program. There are currently three ultrasound disciplines at ARRT, general sonography, vascular sonography, and breast sonography. More information on the specific competency and clinical experience requirements for each of these pathways are available on the ARRT website. Each discipline is broken down into major content category areas. As you can see, sonography covers a vast area including abdomen, obstetrics, gynecology, and small parts, all on one examination. Physics is also included in each of the examinations. Therefore, only one examination is required within each eligibility pathway. Earning certification and registration in sonography and vascular sonography through ARRT allows opportunities to gain additional certifications through ARRT using the post-primary eligibility pathway. If your program offers additional educational classes and opportunity for clinical competency in these areas, MRI, breast sonography, or vascular sonography, a student may also be able to earn eligibility for these while in your program. It might be important for you to know that ARRT ultrasound disciplines are recognized by practice accreditors such as AIUM, IAC, and ACR. ARRT also contributes to the SDMS Foundation in support of programs that benefit the sonography community. ARRT has partnered with other credentialing organizations in revising the scope of practice and clinical standards for the diagnostic medical sonographer. Finally, your students will participate in Continuing Qualifications Requirements, or CQR. This must be completed every 10 years once certification and registration is awarded. This will show your students' employers that their sonographers registered and certified through ARRT, remain qualified.